My name is David Thorson, and I'm a sailor from Iowa. And it's become my mission to try to spread the word of the plight of our oceans and our atmosphere and what's going on with the issue of climate change. My mother taught me to sail on a beautiful glacial lake called Lake Okaboji in Northwest Iowa. It was here that I met a Southern Minnesota hog farmer named Roger Swanson and he gave me the pathway to the sea. Together we sailed to the Arctic's Northwest Passage first in 1994, where we got trapped in the ice, stuck every which way you can, and finally had to retreat, and the Northwest Passage had won again. But we returned just 13 years later and saw a completely changed Arctic where I documented the loss of ice, a 40% loss of ice to our northern polar ice cap. It was through witnessing and documenting these changes to our planet that I finally found my calling in life. And that was to try to bring awareness to our fragile environment and how we're all interconnected on this planet, that what we do on the land as human beings has consequences has consequences for our environment in far off places like our oceans and in the Arctic and polar regions around the planet. So this is what I try to do now, to bring awareness, to educate, to try to inform people to be a bridge between science and the public. I had always been chasing new photos, looking for a new adventure, looking out for what was across the next horizon. Climate change was just a theory that was tossed about by scientists. I had now met this theory face to face. It was real. The golden age of exploration has come to a close. And the beginning of a new era is just starting, the study and change of the Earth's climate. What I have to share with you is really more storytelling than science. But I think what you'll find is that there's a strong argument there to be made that we're having a terrific impact on this planet and that we have great hope for the future and positive change in this new era in which we're living.